Were you going to open the door for me? No. Oh. At the beginning of our marriage, you were so eager to open the door for me. It's because at the beginning of our marriage, I got laid. Where do you want to put all this stuff? Um, in the office. My best friend Casey, who's also my new assistant, is moving out to L.A. from Texas and she's going to stay with Nick and I for a while. Oh my, look at the dust. We obviously do not have a good maid. An idiot buddy who doesn't clean in corners, like. Yeah. Well, I think you need to get a new maid anyway. Huh? I think you should probably get a new maid. I do too, but Nick trusts her. Well, I'm excited to move out here. We can do this all the time. Wouldn't it be great, Nick, though, if I found a place today? You can live by yourself? I think I want to live by myself. Just, I think I'm just excited because I've never lived by myself, and I think I'm just I'm looking forward to that. Do you think that's rude? I can be rude. It's whatever you want. Anyway, I brought two big... You saw my suitcases that I brought. Oh, that's the best thing. I'm going to put it in that closet in the room, I'm saying, so you don't have to deal with them. Is that okay? I don't really have a lot of stuff. You ship them wherever. I'll just throw them in that room. It's not a big deal. You act like you're some big inconvenience. I'm just like that. Like, if someone were to stay at my house, I get real annoyed very easily by stuff like that. Like, <laughs> you don't need that in the house. I know. You know <laughs> Still. <laughs> Jessica, your friend is nuts. <laughs> Shut up. Guys, I got to go. Right? Mm -hmm. Come to get a meeting. All right. Come on. All right. Let's go find me a place to live. <clears throat> you don't want to live anywhere near here, right? No. All right. I mean, that storage, that self-storage place looks nicer than some of them. <laughs> Maybe I should just get a storage unit. It might be cheaper. <laughs> Maybe there's some specials. Do you think they have specials going on? Like, one month free? <laughs> they may want to just see. We have that in Texas. <laughs> yeah, we were interested in looking at, uh, looking at some units if we could. Great, thanks. I think these are junky now. Huh? I think these are junky. You want to look at them or not? No. How do these look? Mm-mm. Okay. What about these? Want to return? Um, uh, no. How do these look? I think they look good. Hi, I'm interested in running, please. Hey, come on. Oh, All right. Man. Sounds like I could talk him down. Do you have one bedroom? We do have one bedroom. We are offering, uh, if you sign a one-year lease, mm -hmm. there is a one-month rent free. Mm -hmm. So let's take it to so a month free. You don't have six weeks free? Does the wash and dryer come with it? It would come with a wash and dryer. In the, included in the rent? Included in the rent. You might lose a little space here. Thank you. What do you think? I'm telling you, apartment hunting, it's, it's a bitch. Oh well, I'll just deal with it when we get back from the rodeo. We're in Houston, Texas, for the livestock show in rodeo. We're going to be singing tomorrow night. Uh, is it cool if we go straight to the restaurant, or we have to yeah. stop? Yeah, okay. Yeah. We're a big happy family. Well, guys, welcome to Houston. Thank, Thank you. you. Hey, did you get a farm yet? We haven't got to wait until I'm gonna I'm just gonna gonna wait till June. Wait till August. Nick and Jesse are just going to adopt me. <laughs> <laughs> so I got the brackets. You got to fill one out. I filled a bracket Wait, I'm out. Fill one out too. Did you? Mm -hmm. Who's winning? I chose. I think I won too. I forgot. You picked Georgia. You, you picked Georgia Tech. I picked Georgia Tech. What do they rate? What do they rank? I don't know. I don't do it by that. Uh, I just do it. What you feel? Yeah. I put That's Georgia Tech exactly. and Xavier going to the end. Work. Well, well, I didn't know Xavier was his rival team. Oh really? Yeah. So he got mad at me. Have you guys been inside yet? Well, they cleared it ahead of time. It's a bit warm, yeah. yeah no I had no idea it was that hot. I'm Oh, Sherry, she took it for you? Ugh. You would well, hate to be like, like when you do that. There was a shirt that said, sink it, sink something, it. slam it. <laughs> no, shoot it, sink it, slam it. No. Shoot it, see it. Is that a basketball shirt? Shoot it, slam it. Another shirt that says shut it, shut it, shut it. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
Activated? Activated? I mean, yeah. no. I got the black card. She has to do that as well. I want one. The perks of that card is. the black card? It's like 24 hour world global ballet. Yeah. Wherever you are. Wow. But it's crazy. I'll send someone to you. So says the myth of the American Express. Black card. You guys ready to roll? You put it in a 10, please? Josh? Babe, what are yes. you doing? Looking for a credit card. <clears throat> Black one? No. Freaking Casey! Jesus, the organizer. I song. lost my credit card. I just need to call and cancel it and then activate this one, I guess. Put the black one in did your we, wallet. Did now. we pay the bill? Yeah. I'll, I'll pay for it. Just look, look for it later. I started kind of freaking out. You got to have a good show, okay? Thank you. No did we put there? We might have to put a credit card down for she dentals. <laughs> Who was that? <laughs> Hell no. <laughs> Speaking of the freaking livestock show. <laughs> <laughs> So at least you guys get to get, get to be home for a while after tomorrow, huh? Mm -hmm. We'll get to be at home. <laughs> the three of us. <laughs> Just the three of us. God. We can make it if we try. I have a common law daughter here before too long. <laughs> yeah. Either that or me, but common law polygamist. <laughs> yeah. Nick had to go to my room every night and set the alarm clock for me. <laughs> it's, like, it's like having two Jessicas. <laughs> <laughs> Bill Jenkins. I've never been to a rodeo before, but I hear it's kind of like the state fair, but with bull riding. Well, pigs are my favorite animal, so I definitely want to meet some pigs. Hey, piggy! There's a pig. Oh, what is that smell? <laughs> I think a pig farted. <laughs> hey, baby. Ah. How you doing? Oh! Hey. Oh, man. Look at ah. I love Texas. I love it. What is up with this animal? Seriously. <laughs> what? Why is he doing that to me? Well, it's too late. I, the shirt's done. Ruined. Oh! I can never say another word about all oh, ever I'm, again. Okay, I'm gonna stick with my hand being licked on it. I don't have any more. Oh. Ah. You just get kiss. Ah. Oh, kind of you see the koala bee? The koala bee? A what? The koala bee. It's a kangaroo, right? No, no, it's a koala Oh, it's a koala. Okay. I wanna go look. Let's go look at it. They have two toes. Their feet, their feet are different than their hands. Like they have like one toe. Come on. I don't want to miss the pig race. Got to call the pig out of the trailer and down to there starting gates. Two. Three. And I need some more cheerleaders from our audience. So, Jessica, could you stand up and help your section cheer on number one? Stand up there. Okay. And here we go with the big girls on the racetrack. Now, these little girls are coming to you right out of Hollywood. Please welcome Sarah Jessica Porker. Out of lane two in the purple, please welcome Christina Hoglera. Give it up for J Lo, Jennifer Lopez. <laughs> All right, she's not so innocent anymore. Please welcome Brittany Spare Ribs. <laughs> All right, is everyone ready for some more pig racing now? There we go. There, rocking up. That was wow. That was funny. That was funny, I will say. How often do they make these pigs do this? Every hour? They probably have different pigs. All they're doing is running in a circle. It's not like they're being tortured. It's, it's not like the bowls exercise. where they tie their balls together. They tie, tie their, their balls together? Yes. Do we get to, get to see a bull? Bulls? Um, at the rodeo. Get up the area. Palm Street. Have you ever done that? Mm hmm You have? It's been a long time. Was it true? Some of their stuff is. Yeah. They said I was going to be very successful, but I think they tell everybody that. And then, <laughs> shut up, Nick. I think she said, you will live rent-free for the year. Yeah.
Shut up. Tropical flavor. I'm gonna try it. I'll be bouncing off the walls. <laughs> it's that stuff. Refuels, rehydrates, complete B complex. Oh, it's a B complex. <laughs> that tastes so bad. Wanna try it? Why the heck would I want to try it when you've been making the ugliest faces imaginable over there drinking it? What am I doing? Watching the Bearcats. The March Madness is probably my favorite sporting event of the year. So, got a little basketball pool I'm doing. Bearcats have always been my team. Been a huge fan my whole life. My happiness rides on their success or failure. This is not good for my heart if this thing's close today. Yeah, oh! 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 Oh, oh son of a I can't watch it with you. I'll call you back. And a foul, where's the foul? Ugh. Now wake up! Don't let him run down the f***ing court again. And now the nine rookies for the under dog. Oh, that's a 90-40 oh. by Gerald Fields to knock it out of bounds. For that big man. Brad, you know a good maid service? Like a company that gives you a good one? No. Like, I, I feel so bad. Like letting the housekeepers go, like every time I move, I decide, I say, well, we're moving, so we're going to make a change. <laughs> I feel bad, because they're really nice, but they're not doing a good job. Nice. Jessica, turn out to me just a little bit this way. Wow. Wow. So fun. Good. Great. Nice. I'll call you back. I, I, I'm having a nervous breakdown. I'll call you back. Please hit that shot. Thank you. Yes, please. Please. Nice. Yes. Yes. <laughs> uh, yes. Uh, oh. Oh. Oh, oh my God! Unbelievable! I'm telling you, I would have, I would have been in the worst mood for the rest of the weekend. Well, I heard that the Bearcats won today, so that's good. That means we'll be in a good mood. Can't believe! Oh yeah, baby! You can see him now. He's so silly. Hey, did you call Eric and ask him my my black card? Well, now you gonna lose that one? No. Supposedly they're they're not doing it anymore. Doing what anymore? After me, the black card. After you? Yeah. The no. last person in history? Yep, they said they're not doing it anymore because they already have all the clients they need. It's full-time valet service, Mom. Like, what do you need valet? Like anything anywhere. you want, there's somebody that'll run out and get it for you or do whatever. You're crazy. Maybe they know a good maid service. Wait, what? I, I'm, I'm confused. I was just gonna see if you could clean the house this weekend. Oh, you work tomorrow? Do you have any time available this weekend? Like, wait, I, I, don't, I don't understand what you're saying. What's okay? I can leave it in the mailbox? Okay, but it, it probably won't be till like the afternoon. Okay? Okay, thanks. Bye. Gosh.
I'm just, I'm just confused. She doesn't understand anything I say. Uh, I think I need, I think we need a new house cleaner though. She doesn't clean. I mean, she like puts everything away, but yeah. Why? Like I, I, I want like mm -hmm. my, when my mom gets her house clean, she has like a team of people come in. What? Well, the problem is too that she doesn't. Every time she comes, our bedroom looks like it looks. You know what I mean? And so she's got right, a thousand things to like go that. through and organize. You put your stuff there, and, and you don't do any of it. So she has to do it all. I Man, that's a lot of you know work. And the one thing about her is I do trust her. And if we just hire some team of people to come in, I mean, that makes me a little jumpy. I just got upset last time because she shrunk like two of my shirts. and. That's just unfortunately part of the territory. Well, I think there's also a communication barrier. He doesn't understand me. Who? Nick. About anything doing with this house. It's okay. We'll work it out eventually. It's only the beginning of our marriage. Hopefully we'll have it down soon. I'm lighting my serenity candles here. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be at peace today. I'm not gonna stress out like I did on Friday. It's round two of the college basketball tournament. A little superstitious today, the spot worked the other day, so I'm gonna stay right here and watch them again and hopefully it'll be a similar result. I'd rather let you sit and watch the game by yourself so I don't get weirded out. I'm gonna have to put my jersey on, maybe Do that's fine. You don't have your jersey on? You have your shorts and your hat on. No, he watches the games in full uniform. He has a hat on, he has his shorts on, and he said maybe it's because I don't have my jersey on. They're not winning. But it's not working so far, right? Mm -hmm. ah! You want to put on some trailing uniforms and stay on the couch and Go, Mary Pets, go. God, go, no, because then I'd just be annoyed. Casey, I think I'm winning in that pool. Stay. I think you think that's a pick. I think like the most stay random people to win, and I was winning. Do you want like a Reuben from Corner Bakery? Yeah, get, yeah, I guess that's fine. Give me whatever. All right, baby, I'll call you. All right. Jeez. Oh, and they're killing our zone again. I don't know why we continue to press and play zone. We just get burned every time. Wake up, wake up. This guy's hit every f shot. Guard him. Ugh. <laughs> Well, we'll wait till next year. Well, I'll say you lost 63 to 87. Whoa. That's kind of blue. <laughs> you guys are trying to be funny or not, Casey Cobb. You got shut down. Shut up, Casey. Shut out. Shut it. You got walked. <laughs> you ever heard the word evicted? <laughs> shut it. <laughs> I hope when y'all have kids that your kids are good in sports. <laughs> you imagine if your kids. No, our, if we have sons, they're gonna want to be ballerinos. Ballerinos. Oh. Ballerino. Guys are oh, what's O's? Oh, masculine. Ballerina. Ballerino. Guess who's in first place in the entire freaking thing? My wife. She is flat out, flat out winning this stupid thing. This is this, this what you don't understand. This is a fluke. Mm -hmm. I know what I'm doing. It's not a <laughs> fluke. All right, man. Later. God, I'm ready. You want to try me? No. You don't seem excited to see me. Sorry, I'm a little tired. I do my car wheel. <laughs> well, I know the right place is out there for me. I need an apartment locator is what I need. Shut up, Casey. Next time on Newlyweds. Yo, for the record, the That's dishwasher ain't gonna clean that. Do you ever notice when Nick is doing something? He goes, Nick.
Well, he's been weird to me lately. I think it's because I'm at the house still. You don't even know you're in the house. What are you talking about? I think it'd be good for her to get her own place. At some point, she's got to get her own life out here, you know? Did you check the movies? Go for it. Just call and check. What in the world are you guys doing that's keeping you from looking up a freaking movie time?